Dozens of line workers from right here in the midstate are headed to Florida and South Carolina to help get the power back on to more than 300,000 people in the dark this morning. News Channel 5, Sophie Nielsen holding as at Middle Tennessee Electric in Murfreesboro. And Sophie, we understand they're getting ready to take off in the next few minutes. That's right, Amy. They're all arriving right now, getting ready to take these trucks down to Florida. 12 people from Middle Tennessee Electric will be going. That's three crews here to tell us a little bit more about it. Josh Clinton from Middle Tennessee yes. Electric. Uh, what will they be doing once they get down there? Our crews are actually going down to uh, provide some restoration effort uh, assistance to uh, Clay Electric Cooperative down uh, in, uh, in uh, Kingston Heights. Uh, so they're going down there just to, to help restore power. You know, right now there's about 200,000 people that are out uh, in Florida uh, out of power. And so uh, it's since power is such an essential uh, necessity that, that folks need uh, not only to operate but also for uh, responders, they're going down there just to help them, uh, you know, restore those power. Touch on that a little bit. We've got such a massive cleanup effort possibly ahead of us. Why is it important for the utility workers to get the, down there as soon as possible? And why is the electricity such an integral part of that? Well, you know, as 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 we continue to grow uh, in you know throughout the United States, uh, the the electrical infrastructure becomes more. We become more and more dependent on it. So everyday life is powered by what these co-ops and what these municipalities and investor-owned utilities provide. Uh, and so cleaning that up and making sure that that power is ready to go, that's what our crews are headed down there for, just to make sure that, that people have that be able to function. Everything from hospitals to people's homes Absolutely. to businesses. Absolutely. Uh, you know, here in Middle Tennessee Electric, uh, a lot of folks rely on that, uh, you know, 214,000 members. Uh, and that's what, that's what our crews are going down there uh, to help out with, is just to make sure that people can, can turn their lights on. That's great. And 12 guys are going, but I'm, I've heard that more than that volunteered to go. So That's there's right. definitely a spirit of helping out down here. Uh, they're going to be heading out within the next 30 minutes, so we'll keep you up to date. Live in Murfreesboro, Sophie Nelson Colding, News Channel 5.